Hi everyone, this is Mark. Uh, welcome to my video. And as I had mentioned in my preview video a couple of days ago, um, this is one of the um, items I wanted to review. This is Elvis Portraits, uh, 1953 to 1977, A Life in Photos by Eric Lawrenson and Robert Van Beek. Um, as I mentioned, uh, this is about a uh, eight pound book. Uh, as you can see, it's pretty thick. There's the back cover, really awesome picture. That's actually the first I've seen the back cover. I've actually thumbed through this book. Um, it is as advertised. So this consists of all of Elvis's publicity stills, um, pub publicity stills for his movies, um, some concert photos, uh, there's even some of the Madison Square Garden uh, press conference in here. So um, I just got this yesterday. I did have some time to look through it. And I will say in a word, it is magnificent. Um, so 400 pages, as I mentioned. Um, about 500 pictures or so. So I'm not going to go through the whole thing. Obviously, for sake of time, I'm just going to kind of thumb through some of the highlights. Um, but it begins from the... Uh, from the very beginning, 1953. I've seen that shot before, as I'm sure many of you have. Don't recall that shot. Um, so we'll just go through this real quick. Kind of jump ahead. I'd probably say this is around early 1955 or 56. I think that was from stills from Love Me Tender. Uh, you've seen that picture. I'm sure you've seen that picture. A lot of these pictures have been featured on 45 covers, um, some of his albums, other things. That's actually a really cool picture. Uh, I've seen that on a cover of, I believe, the VPI Loving You release on vinyl. Um, <clears throat> but these are really high-quality pictures, uh, high-quality um, stock pages. That's from... Jailhouse Rock. A lot of you have seen this. So, again, I'm not going to go through the entire uh, book. Obviously, 400 pages, that would take a while. So, I'm just going to kind of skip a little bit ahead. Um, these pictures I've seen that were taken on Halloween, I believe, of 19, probably 57 <clears throat> or so. King Creole photo shoots. Always like that picture. <clears throat> Always like that one as well. There is the actual photo that was taken for the cover of King Creole, as you all know. Um, cool picture of him. Well, what he's sitting in there. <clears throat> There's a picture with his mom and his dad, and that wasn't long before Gladys Presley passed away. So it was kind of sad. That was a sad time for Elvis. <clears throat> like this is when he got the news that she had passed, and I've seen this picture where, you know, Elvis had got the news, and Elvis took his mother's death very hard. Obviously, he was very close to his mom. Um, there's him, I believe, in France <clears throat> for the um, big hunk of love uh, shoot that was made for that release of that 45. <clears throat> this is a lot of you have seen these pictures on his return home from the army in March of 1960. <clears throat> um, always like these pictures. This picture, of course, was the cover of the Ellis' Christmas album beginning, I think, in 59, maybe? <clears throat> and going forward through, through like 1968. There is the cover of the FTD uh, Elvis's Back Sessions. Um, we've seen these pictures, seen that picture, also on the cover of an album that I've seen that I have somewhere, Elvis Return. We've seen this picture, I always like that picture as well. Uh, trying to go through this quickly. <clears throat> I think back here I remember was the Frank, Frank Sinatra special, just really cool. Some of them were just really cool, candid uh, photos of him, but I thought those, there it is, there's the uh, March 1960 uh, Frank Sinatra Timex special, so moving ahead, 
Very cool picture of Elvis. And these are all stills from the GI Blues movie. I'm not sure who that gentleman is. I'll have to read on it later. Shots from, there's he and Juliet Prowse. So I'm just gonna kind of move ahead a little bit, again, for sake of time. I think this is Flaming Star, Wild in the Country. Always liked this picture. Always really liked this picture, too. Always said that was such a good picture. This is for the Something for Everybody uh, photo shoot. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, and I think this is him at the, yeah, at the uh, Ellis Auditorium for the charity concert in February of 1961. <clears throat> this is right before he left to go to... Actually, no. They have these kind of out of order because this is the night this is the October 1960 photo shoot that was done for his hand in mine, which was recorded in October, late October of 1960. Actually, Halloween, October 31st. October it was like a full night session of recordings. Always like these pictures too. Really good pictures of Elvis. Quite a few of them. That's a good picture. That's a Really good picture as well. And then here we are, Blue Hawaii. So he left in March to record and then, of course, film his most popular movie and most popular soundtrack album. And actually, arguably one of his most popular albums he ever released in his lifetime. So, and here's the potluck sessions, or the potluck photo shoot. I had never seen that picture before until yesterday. <clears throat> a potluck movie that was an album that was made. Um, and of course, Kid Galahad. Another one of Kid Galahad. I think this is on to Follow That Dream. And then, of course, the Girls, Girls, Girls photo shoot in 1962. I always thought these came out really good as well. Some of these pictures were included in the uh, bonus insert of the Girls 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 album uh, as a calendar. Um, it was the, just a one sheet, but it was multiple pictures of Elvis, and was, these were included. <clears throat> this was, I believe, in, yep, World World's Fair, 1963. So just kind of jumping ahead here a little bit for sake of time. I know I've said that like 15 times already. Viva Las Vegas. Viva Las Vegas. So I'm actually just going to move ahead. Quite a bit here. I think that is uh, Girl Happy. Yep. More of Girl Happy. Uh, Tickle Me. This co star. Tickle Me. So just jumping ahead. Harem Scarum. That's the cover of the uh, Elvis's Gold Records Volume 4. Harem Scarum. So just jumping ahead. Frank and Johnny. It just says portraits, easy come, easy go. <clears throat> Stay away, Joe. I've actually jumped ahead several pages. Speedway. Uh, live a little, love a little. We've seen these pictures before. Uh, I'll move ahead. It's the comeback special. Charo. Change of habit. 1969, there's he and Priscilla. The press conference in uh, Vegas in July, right before he uh, started his uh, going on, uh, appearing in concert. Always love that jumpsuit. One of my favorites. There's the cover of uh, Elvis on stage, the FTD LP. So really great pictures. Everyone's seen that one. So again, just jumping ahead. One of my another one of my favorite jumpsuits. And of course, here's the uh, New York uh, Madison Square Garden um, press conference. It, what surprised me is here they had no pictures of the shows from the four shows. It just went right into September of 70, uh, 72 in Vegas. Here's he and Muhammad Ali, he and Linda Thompson, Aloha, great pictures there. 
So again, just moving the head on these quickly. Elvis being presented with one of his many, many awards. That was, uh, that was August of 73. There's one, another one of his famous jumpsuits. We've all seen this picture of him, and I think that's Red West. So, getting towards the end here. <clears throat> There's his suit, like I call it a suit jacket concert. There's him with a fan. There's a picture of him getting ready to go on stage. We don't really have a whole lot uh, at the end of his last couple years in concerts. There's him, I believe this, he was taken at a police station. It was like almost like a, uh, not a monk shop, but like he had visited to get one of his many badges. And I think that's pretty much it. And then it closes with that. So this last, there's the last picture. So yeah, um, you can get this book. Um, it's about where I got it. It was about $100 and like another $12, $13 to ship it. <clears throat> but it is well worth it. Um, fantastic, fantastic book. Highly recommend it. Beautiful, clear pictures. Again, 400 pages, about eight pounds. Um, that's why it was so uh, expensive to ship it because of the weight. <clears throat> and uh, you can get it on Elvis Shop of London. You can get it in numerous places if you just check online. So thanks for watching. Thanks for those who have subscribed and liked and your many comments. I appreciate it. Um, hoping to have another video out the next day or so. And I hope you all have a great rest of your day. Take care.